So I've been scrolling through Facebook groups as I typically do and you know, true to form almost every day, sometimes every couple days, you'll see a post about what microphone systems should I invest in. And sometimes you see some pretty good information that's out there. And sometimes you see some uh, fairly, uh, you know, some, somebody should really be questioning this. Now, one of the first things of caution to think about is people recommending 2.4 gigahertz microphones. You know, Sennheiser has some, Audio-Technica, Rode, Sony. There's a bunch of brands, some really good quality brands that make units in uh, this particular part of the spectrum. I personally would stay away from that unless you're doing something, let's say karaoke or whatnot. There's just too much risk putting in something that microwaves, something that people's cell phones and Bluetooth, other you know, security systems. There's a lot of things that operates on this side of the spectrum that could just cause way too many headaches to ever really consider in a, you know, in a uh, critical environment. So, you know, unless there's just no other option available I and mean, there's plenty of options, Stay away from the 2.4 gigahertz spectrum. Focus on the 470 to 608 uh, megahertz spectrum. There's also a couple oddball sidebands as well that you can operate under I mean, the 900 uh, uh, spectrum. I think 174 is another one. They're relatively small, but there are operable in those. Just stay away from 2.4, focus on the pro bands. Now, another thing to consider is, yes, there are some budget entry units from GTD, from Phoenix, um, and some others. You know, again, if you're doing something like karaoke or whatnot, that's totally fine. But if you're doing something like weddings, caveat emptor, do not invest in these. They're just, you're, you're going to end up crying later on uh, wishing that you had bought a better unit. So the best bang for the buck right now is the Sennheiser EWD line. Um, it is making the most use of the spectrum while allowing also things like managing it on your phone. Uh, they're just really, really great units. Best bang for the buck uh, by far, but there's also great units from Audio-Technica, Shure and others to consider. But personally for me, I'm a Sennheiser person anyways. I still have the G3 microphones. I would go with EWDs if I got some something new. And most importantly, you should be live mixing and EQing this noise. You want to be able to take out those harmonics that the microphones do you know, replicate and gives you that feedback. You want to notch those out with a proper EQ. And I don't care what brand of microphone that you have, you can properly EQ across the spectrum on um, almost any type of microphone. So invest heavily in a great mixer. So in summary, stay away from 2.4 gigahertz, invest in quality microphones, and definitely invest in a quality mixer. This is the formula for success with microphones.